No man is an island, or so the saying goes. We are all connected to a whole variety of people, drawing different things from each of these relationships. Without realising it, this web of relationships can offer opportunities, enabling us to achieve our dreams. But at the same time, it can strain us, holding us back, hindering our progress. In the same way, groups and organisations are connected to other groups and organisations, which can either enable and so encourage success, or hinder and lead to failure. Based on graph theory, network analysis is focused on uncovering the hidden pattern of relationships that occur within, across and between organisations, both the formal and the informal ones. Identifying and understanding this pattern of relationships provides valuable insights into commonplace and widespread organisational activities, such as decision making and knowledge sharing, or team working and leadership. Until recently, network data could only be captured retrospectively through surveys, interviews, or analysis of documented communication, such as an email exchange. However, advances in wearable technologies now allow the capture and real-time analysis of sociometric data on how the interaction patterns can impact both individuals and organisations. Complex change issues rarely sit within the responsibility of any one individual, group or organisation. So, to solve the toughest problems, we need effective communication, exchange of information and ideas, and collaborative working. In the leading complex change group at Cranfield, we use our organisational network analysis tool to map and analyse the relationships within and across a client organisation. With a focus, on understanding the complex issues they face. This enables us to look at the relationships between key internal and external individuals or groups, providing insights and solutions to real practical problems. Individuals attending a Cranfield programme discover their position within their personal network and the impact they're having on others. They also gain an overview of the many relationships between actors involved in a particular issue. This yields actionable insights and measurable business impact. Organisational network analysis can also enable employees to first identify and develop enduring and significant relationships that cross internal and external organisational boundaries. Second, develop better communication strategies to ensure effective knowledge sharing. And third, discover the different roles played by colleagues in supporting and enhancing their own activity. Similarly, it can enable managers to identify key players tackling significant issues, points of communication breakdown, blockages to knowledge transfer and dysfunctional leadership arrangements. For instance, to facilitate organisational change, managers may engage employees with significant relationships across functional lines, physical distance, hierarchical levels or core projects to minimise points of resistance. So, if you're asking some of these questions, who are the influencers in your organisation? Who are your value creators? Who are the bottlenecks that limit the performance of your organisation? Who are the boundary spanners that bridge communities in your organisation? Then we can help.